Hey everybody, my name is Dr. Morgan Renberg and I'm the chief scientist here at the Fort Worth Museum of Science and History. We got a great question on Facebook recently from Savannah. She's three and wants to know what kinds of dinosaurs used to live here in North Texas. The answer, of course, is that there were tons of cool dinos living here back then. I mean, what kind of dinosaur isn't cool? Scientists break the age of the dinosaurs into three big periods called the Triassic, Jurassic, and Cretaceous. The rocks on the surface here in North Texas date to that last period, the Cretaceous, and they're all around 75 to 115 million years old. Back then, parts of the country were actually covered by a shallow ocean called the Western Interior Seaway. You can see in this picture that that sea was pretty much right on top of us. In fact, Dallas was probably underwater, while Fort Worth and Tarrant County would have been right along the shore. One of the ways that we know this is because we found the fossils of animals that were definitely living in the water. The picture on the left, for example, shows the fossilized shell of an ancient turtle, while the one on the right uh, is called an ammonite. Ammonites were extinct relatives of the squids and octopi that we have today. One of the coolest dinosaurs found around here is Paluxosaurus jonesi, a giant plant-eating sauropod. This photo from the museum's atrium shows the most complete skeleton in the world. Back in 2009, Texas actually declared Paluxosaurus its state dinosaur because it's just that darn cool. Another neat Texas dinosaur we have here at the museum is Tenontosaurus dasi. Back in 1988, it was found by a kid who was just out for a walk. That's why it's so important to always keep your eyes peeled for new discoveries. Tenontosaurus was another plant eater. Since it didn't have sharp teeth, paleontologists think it could swing its powerful tail to help scare away predators. One of those predators was probably Acrocanthosaurus, who is kind of like a smaller, fatter T-Rex. Here's a size comparison to a person. It might be no T-Rex, but you would definitely want to steer clear. If you'd like to see these dinosaurs and more in person, you can check them out here at the Fort Worth Museum of Science and History. Thanks again to Savannah for this question, and if you've got a question just as cool as hers, you can leave it in a comment here or post it to our Facebook. We'll try to make a video. And of course, if you want more of this great content, make sure you like this video and subscribe to our channel. See you next time.